Hey there, everybody that here, and welcome back to that please. XCOM 2 War. What was it, Chosen? Got alien alloys available, if we wanted to go after them. Don't think we do. But if you did, there they are. Got a gorilla op available, too. Now, we might be... Might be getting to the threshold here, biting off just a little bit more than we could chew. We just had a mission. There are three people wounded, five people tired. But 45 ready to go. Um, the problem is our best and brightest, are they ready to go? Well, I mean, two of them are now good to go, so I guess maybe we are. Um, but we have one option here, and just one option. There's a lot of Pathfinders here. Let's go to Counter Bending Reed. We got an escort and resistance operative to a workstation. So there are Reaper friends here. There are Templar friends here. Interesting. Two groups of friends. Exalted hunters and, of course, more freaking hello, ethereal. And the lost. But, uh, ethereal. <laughs> ethereal? You don't say. Okay. Mm. Well, for this one, we need some spicy team members. Okay. We need to be able to do as much damage as possible in as little time as possible, basically. We're escorting someone to a workstation. We could, that is a good argument to maybe bring Angela to this mission. I think Parrish might be a good choice. Well, no, we have to fight the Lost. Hopefully we'll bring him to the next mission instead. You know, be excited to see him go out there. Hans is injured. That's not great. Hmm. And purple does not have maximum stuff. I'd like to bring psionics. I think it'd be a good idea, but mm, he's not ready. Sai's not ready. <clears throat> Even Vasilla's not really a, like in top condition. This is going to be spicy. I feel like. All right. Well, we have to decide who to put in. I could bring in Reynold. He's in top condition. He's ready to rock and roll. Dismas did go on a mission recently. So it wouldn't necessarily be the best idea to bring him, but if we did, I know he'd rock. Hmm. Butcher's ready to go? I think that could be really good. I don't want to go too melee heavy, though, so we gotta we gotta be careful here. Rathburger and Wingus are out on a covert action, unfortunately, because I'd love to bring them to this mission. But they aren't ready. See, Bale has really good overwatch, and Chillings, I think we could use a doctor in this mission. We could use a doctor in this house. So, we're gonna bring both of them. As soon as I can find Chillings on this list. Okay. And then three more. I do think if we have an Ethereal on the battlefield, we should bring as many as we can. So... I'm really tempted to bring Silvermane. I think it's a good idea. Let's bring Silvermane. Let's bring Mox. We can bring Mox. I think that's a good idea to have someone who can give others some extra moves. Could be pretty useful in this one. And then finally, if we head down towards the bottom of the list. Ah, Viking's a little tempting. Let's see. We could bring Moke. Let's bring Moke. I, I, I like the idea of having the skirmishers because they get the multiple shots per turn, and I think that could be very useful here. Let's see, Angela, you have 10 points available. Let's make you immune to fire and poison. This isn't really the most helpful mission for it, but eh, we have the points. We can spend them. Let's go. Okay, Angela's here to be able to heal Silvermane, and then Chillings is here to be able to heal everyone else. In position for deployment. I don't know how this one's going to go. It's apparently a magma monster mission. The old triple M. Ah, as you do, as you do. All right. Trying some new drinks. This one today we're drinking the uh, sparkling ice fruit punch flavored sparkling water. Zero sugar with vitamins and antioxidants. What kind of vitamins? Well, it has some B6. It has some B12. It has some biotin. Do you like biotin? I like biotin, so I think it's pretty great. Do you know what pantothenic acid is? I have no idea, but you have 50% of your daily value in this drink. Mmm. Yum, yum. It is pantothentastic, I tell ya. 
absolutely great. I'm trying to cut down on caffeine a bit. Which means next week I'm going to have, like, horrible chills and headaches, probably. But, <laughs> you know. You got to do what you got to do. We'll see how it works out in the long run, right? I heard you, Sky Ranger. You're going. You're prepping for the sauce. It, it, it does take, you know, this drink does contain 1% juice. So that's pretty good. That's why it has five calories instead of zero. So hold on to your butts. But it is low calorie and caffeine free. What the heck's the ingredient list? Oh, it's on the side. Why is the ingredient list vertical while all the other text is horizontal? It is mostly carbonated water with apple juice concentrate and vegetable and fruit juice for color. <laughs> Not even for flavor. It's just fruit juice for color. I don't know. I didn't see that coming. I didn't know you could do that. He's gonna put juice in it, but not 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 for flavor, not for calories, not for vitamins and minerals. This is just for the color of it. Just squeeze some carrots in there to get that right, you know, shade of orange. Well, it's a fruit punch drink, so it's not really orange that they're going for. But you're picking up what I'm putting down. It's actually more reddish, but anyway, there's Sky Ranger. All right. Central, I'm waiting for you next. Come on, tell me about this mission. Every possible outlet to gain information on the aliens' latest project. And in this case, that means infiltrating one of their facilities to access an exposed terminal connected to their network. You got it. Hostile forces will be in position to defend the site. Good to know. So we'll have to neutralize any threats to lock down the area. You heard him. It's a killing mission. Can. We need that data if we're going to stop their progress. All right, off the Hobart. One of the ruins of... This should be good. I'm feeling it. At least a little bit. Silverman was 37 health. Uh, Alright, those are either the Reapers or the Templars. The laptop's upstairs. That's good to know. Alright, where's the Hacksmith? Where's Reynold? Shocking. Be careful out there. I don't think Reynold has anything to worry about, honestly, but appreciate the uh, warnings nonetheless. He can actually shoot someone from here. Do we need to be quiet? I mean, maybe. Probably. Honestly. Move up, uh, no problem. Butcher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So our best hacker, not including the person who's supposed to do the hacking, is going to be Angela Broca. You have fun with that. There's a Pathfinder Hunter. Wow, they have a lot of armor. I probably knew that at one point and I forgot about it. All right, move up, Reynold. Follow my lead. Okay. Worst case scenario, we use you as cover. Moving out. Okay. Yeah, like this. There you go. Scanning. Okay, we're going to be quiet for at least a turn or two. Hello, uh, Marina Ivanova. I'm pretty sure I've heard, I know someone else with this exact name. I could be wrong. She did not have that accent, but she had that name. Uh, Moke, move up. To that position. If possible, I'd love to get you upstairs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, let's get you up here for now. Yeah, just go through that truck. Why not? Okay, there's one of the Pathfinders. Attacking on sight. Okay, Doc. What's up? So let's just get you up here next to uh, Ivanova for now. Mox. I will go. Let's see what you got with the grapple. Uh, we can get you on the other side, sure. Utilizing hook. All right. The skirmishers have our upstairs covered. Watch order confirmed. Okay, Randall, you don't need to do anything yet. Silvermane, let's go ahead and scoot you up. And Angela, let's go ahead and scoot you up as well. Uh, you can use Silvermane as full cover, so why not? All right, let's let them do a thing and see what happens here. Okay, Pathfinders are finding paths. I'm assuming that's them finding the lost and not finding us, right? Well, now they found us. 74%, oof. 
But it's a kill, so hey, terror rounds. Stun my- Ooh, and this is a mission where we have to kill everyone. Fantastic opening line, by the way. But yeah, this is a, this is a match where we're supposed to kill everyone. That's great for us. Hello, Lost. Well, now everything knows we're here. All of China knows we're here now. Good kill, Bell. Keep them coming. Nice. Nice job, Mox. Nice job again, Mox. What is that? Uh, grapple? Alright, I'll give you something to grapple. I'm not gonna say my ass after that line. You can't make me. Alright, Butcher's still in stealth, thankfully. What I'd really like is for her to find the ethereal before uh, it sees us. That'd be ideal. And to find our friends, too. That'd be cool. Just watching them climb that ladder, though. Target neutralized. Kill confirmed. That's two more down. Wow. And another one for Mox, too. This uh, Overwatch was quite a great scam. There you go. That's what I was looking for, Mo. Good stuff. Hey, and he wasn't done with one. You had to give him the double. Oh, is he going to get a triple? Mm, no, because Bale's going to take it. I knew he was going to miss that shot. All right, good stuff. How about that grappler? Ooh, no, no, no. Wait for it. And no, nobody had shots. I wouldn't be surprised if Bale's out of ammo at this point. All right, resistance activity. Hey, there's our Templar friends. Let's go, Templar friends. They, uh, aren't doing much. I wish they were more uh, help, but I guess this is cool. Thanks, guys. Alrighty then. Silvermane just slapped another round in there, so he's ready to rock and roll. Okay. Reynold, could have you up and have you go up here and just start doing some fighting. Tell you what, go ahead and slap this guy for us. Stand on top of the truck bed so that everyone knows you're here for business. All right, hit him. What would you have me do? Dare you? It's a howl over there. Love to take that out before it does its thing, but I don't know if that's gonna happen. Okay, up next, uh, butcher. I'm going to have you hold off here. We can, we're going to see if we can take out that grappler first. No, actually, he did not run out of ammo. He just ran out of time, I guess. Orders confirmed. Moving he, out. he ran out of, like, sight, but I, I know. Okay. Let's go ahead and get the free kill first. Actually, get the free kill with the... No, actually, take your primary weapon shot. I don't know if the hand cannon will get the free shot or not. Or the free move. Okay. 89%, 82%. The result is still a death. So let's go ahead and sacrifice the 7%. And he shot a little high. Enemy is still up. That hurt. That hurt. Mainly my soul. But, ooh, did it hurt it bad. All right. Okay, Ivanova, let's get you closer to the thing. Remember, the thing is up here. That's actually not too far away for, for her. That's right. Get pistoled, son. It didn't do much. But that's okay. It, it did... Not really what we needed it to, to be honest with you. Alright, you know what? Give me the quick zap here. Alright, Doc. Go ahead and sling a chain lightning at everyone. Which is two people, but only two people can be stunned. Apparently the loss can't be stunned. Who cares? They're down for four freaking moves. Or two full turns. That's the sauce I needed. Plus, it was a quick zap, so he still gets a shot. Is it gonna get a kill? Hot dog. Good for you. No, the fight. I, I meant the fight. <laughs> Settle down, buddy. <laughs> All right. Move up, Moke. All right. Wasn't your best round last time, so hopefully you can make up for it here. Uh, Tell you what. Let's get Mox I down here on the other side. Okay. Moke, what you got? Nothing? Mm, that's fine. Go ahead and actually give me a reload. Cover me. Reloading. And then give me the overwatch from here. Butcher can move past here in a little bit, and that's really what I need. Uh, see if you can blap this guy for me. Mox is kicking some ass. 62% of the time. He's kicking some real ass. Damn. 
Oh, and he gets a zero in, too. He is kicking literally all the ass. Alright. Butcher, let's move you up a little bit. Remember, you still have a little bit of stealth going on, so I'm gonna have you... Alright. We're gonna have you come over here and grab the stuff. Where is that bloody ethereal, though? Is that a banana in the traffic cone? That's a banana in the traffic cone. Who put my banana in the traffic... I don't know, man. That's how you can tell this city really is a ruin. Anyway. Okay, two more of them over there. That one might be led... This one might be led by an ethereal. We can't confirm this yet, but it may or may not be true. Silvermane, move up. Apparently your stompy ass is going to get someone's attention. Hello. Yes. Yeah, you you are there. Go ahead and slap yourself in the long range mode. Because, hey, if they can see us, we should be allowed to see them, right? It's only fair. Uh, give me an overdrive. He may be too good at this game, but whatever. Um, Pathfinder, Pathfinder, Exalted Hunter. Uh, it's not a guaranteed crit chance. Let's go ahead and take out the other two. We'll let the big guy... Uh, See if you can avenge his teammates here. Alright, then go ahead and slap the other one as well. Alright, exalted Pathfinder Hunter, let's see what you got. Oh yeah, and also accept our dominion. Alright, move up a little bit, Angela. You have so many options for things. You can give someone squad sight? I forgot about that. You can give someone a free action point. Well, what the hell? Hey, Silvermane. You're not done. <laughs> Angela says you're not done yet. And her spark gremlin. Her gremlin agrees. He's like, alright, alright, I'm turning around. Jeez, I'll go fight some more. <laughs> hey, I've been ordered to fight some more. No offense. But you're dead. God damn. Alright. We're not using Reynolds' extra move yet. Oh, there he is. It just floats in from the back. Alright. Well. There's old forearms. Oh, it is immediately attacking. I think. No, I have no idea what it did. <laughs> Alright. Ideally, we need to slap this thing with our strongest attack immediately. Otherwise, yeah, it's going to summon two free groups. Right? Well, I mean, it hasn't summoned a tank yet, so that's good. All right, but it did summon an elite Naha and a Spectre. Okay. Inspector is a problem. The Ethereal is also theoretically a problem. Wow! It just attacked the Pathfinder Hunter. Like, zero chill. And ruptured it. Alright then. You see where their allegiances lie? To themselves. I guess that's fitting. Alright. Now, I do have options. I mean, I, I have the silver main butt if I need to use it. Which I probably will end up using it, to be fair. Please shoot that. Actually, shoot the Pathfinder for me. And that's why I wanted you to shoot the, sh to shoot the, the Pathfinder for me. Ooh. Yeah, that's not great. Wait, chasing fire? Well, you didn't reflect that, did you, big boy? Holy crap. He can get chasing fire off of uh, third-party shots. That's phenomenal. Okay, you're going to shoot the Naha for me? Yaha. I appreciate that. Hey. Right. Oh, good. They're actually going after other targets for me, which is great because I think the Ethereal has a big buff that prevents it from taking too much damage per turn, if I remember right. Okay. Well, only one reflection wasn't that bad. Alright. All the reloads going. Uh, why did that truck explode? It wasn't even a fire. 
What the hell? Uh, okay. Well, we could have someone just run up and bash somebody. Tell you what, you have Smite available. It has a chance at a stun, which could be very helpful. Then again, you also have the 5 million Mishan moves available. Chosen Dagger Throw. That ends the turn, though. Which is not great. This is the laser grenade. I don't know why I have them on. Why I have that on Reynold, but I do. Mm. There's a chance of killing the Naha. So I say let's take it. Come on, Reynold. Maximum damage for me if you can. Oh, you can't. That's all right. If anyone tried to attack you in melee or silver you can just do nothing. All right, well. Dang. That's too bad. All right. Could always give you your extra move. Let's go ahead and use that now. Okay. Uh, yeah, and then just use your extra move to punch it with the bolt. No. I mean, honestly, that's tempting. But I could also have you, like, use your slash to come up and attack this specter. Now, the specter is an elite. But I don't think that's too bad. It doesn't sh vanish if it takes damage. I think it takes a turn to do that. So go ahead and um, slap it so someone else can come in and kill it. Okay. Angela. Chaining Jolt. Six to eight damage. It won't hurt you. Let's see. Yeah, they receive 66% reduced damage if they've taken damage. They've been hit twice by attacks in the same turn, and they slowly regenerate health. Solace. Irradiated. That's going to be good for us. Psionic Shielding. Once alerted. Immunity. Yeah, they immunize themselves against ascetic, thermal, cryogenic, and electrical damage. Gosh darn it. You know who's not immune to electrical damage? This specter. Take it out. That's probably the second most annoying enemy here, so it's got to go. And, and, you know, if that electrical charge wants to jump over that Naha, I wouldn't complain. It went the other way, but that's okay, too. It stunned one of them, so it's more than okay. Angela, you're going to be able to basically carry the world on your back from that corner there. Uh, we do have a 100% chance to hit here. 6 to 7 damage. Ugh. Give me a lightning strike. Yeah, come up here and uh, punch the snake for me. Good lightning. Beautiful. Alright. You could then punch that guy. Uh, whoa, your accuracy went down from here. Okay, then. Uh, we could do a power shot. I mean, if it does 14 to 17 damage, then get the hell out of my house. It's probably going to be reduced. But it wasn't reduced enough. Sorry, Templar Knight. Uh, yeah, yeah, you threw our, our friends in the rubble, too. But, you know, I'm going to assume you didn't do that on purpose. Get over here, Mox. You got a shot from here? You do. 33%. Ugh. All right. Is this cover? This is cover. Move over here. I will move. Hey, is it cover for that other guy? I'm actually surprised that it's not a flank, but I guess I'm not really. Okay, go ahead and use Fortify. Gives you 20 defense for free. And then, yeah, just come over here and slap him. Ooh, it burns them too. Nice. Okay. Good stuff. Moak, I'm probably going to want you on Overwatch duty over here. Go ahead and get under this heavy cover. Yeah, give me Overwatch duty. Okay. Doc. Move up here, Doc. Give you a good view of the entire battlefield. Which means you have a good spot to start healing from. At least in theory. Not so hard. Alright. I have Nova. Go ahead and move behind. Uh, actually, move over here. Come on. Okay. Alright, Butcher. I don't know if I want... Wait, Bale, what do you have? 45. Ugh, ugh, ugh. All bad chances at hits. Ready to engage. Go ahead and give me the Overwatch instead. All right, Butcher, we took out the most dangerous of the enemies here. So I tell you what, go ahead and Shadow Walk. I got it. And you could literally aim at any of them, huh? 
Go, go get this hunter. Hello. Don't mind me. Beautiful. That was invigorating. Sorry, what'd you say about me, you little bitch? Oh my god, she literally teleported. <laughs> Nothing personnel, kid. This can't be good. Oh, that was great. Alright, a muton commandant, and I didn't see what the other one was, but it wasn't a tank, and that's what's important. Okay. Oh, it's a uh, Melistarius. Okay. Hello! Nice helmet. Love it. You look great. Now die. How do you keep getting, like, nice follow-up there, Moke? How do you keep getting, like, 40% accuracy from long range with your regular shots, but then, like, 80% with overwatches? That was a graze, but it's still irradiated. Come on, Moak, clean him up. Oh! Doc! That was a good hit, Doc. He's irradiated, all right. I just can't see how much health he has up there. But th the Doc might be able to clean him up. All right, this guy. Retribute his ass. Try to run away from Mox? Heck no. Mox is absolutely just rocking it and rolling it. Who are you shooting at? Nobody. You're throwing a grenade. You can lob a grenade that far? What an arm, dude. All right. Well, the lost is here. Not that they weren't already. What was that? Is that like a revealing grenade? It didn't seem to do any damage. It seemed a little weird. Ah, uh, yeah. Half of them now are going to go around that guy. That's great. Woof. It looks like it hurt. All right, bail from downtown. Love it. Hostile neutralized. Come on. Oh, you couldn't have come a little bit closer, huh? Are you scared? Kill him, kill him, kill him. That'd be a bit glorious. Oh, close, but no kill. So this guy's just going to clean him up for us, I assume. No, no, he's stopping the lost. Thank you, Bishop. Sorry for uh, killing that knight earlier. I promise it wasn't the intention. You gonna kill that one, though? Oh, wow, you are. I thought that was not gonna be able to do enough damage. I learned today. Dude, this bishop is just cleaning up for us. Get them all. That one's got eight health. I was gonna say, I don't think you're taking out the one with eight health, either. So. But that's what the others are for, right? The Apostle? That was a nice crit. But still no dice. Another Apostle. You got power shot, didn't you? Oof. All right. Very good, very good. Then the last Apostle gets a miss. Frick. Okay. I think that was a pretty good turn. The Ethereal, uh, whew, went down pretty easily, all things considered. Okay. Bail. Let's move you up a little bit more. Moving to designated coordinates. We are still going to have to worry about whoever comes out of the last one there, so I'm going to have you stick behind cover. Plastic cover, but cover nonetheless. Take these 100% shots, please. Okay. Taken care of. Mm, you only have a certain number of shots left, so I tell you what, take one more, and then let's go into Overwatch for those two guys, or however many guys are going to come out behind the garbage can, okay? Okay. Marina can't quite get you up there yet. All right. It's close. It's close. Doc, kill. Bang. That weapon shoots some giant ass fireballs. Hello. How are you? You are irradiated already, so I think you're going to die no matter what. So uh, just enjoy this stun so you can die while standing still. Sorry, but his host. Oath was do no harm, and, uh... Oh, but, uh, Silvermane's oath was... He had no such oath. He just missed. That was gonna be such a badass moment there. And, and, and you goofed it. Uh, don't you worry about that. Honestly, I don't want you to worry about that thing either. Just go into Overwatch for now. Okay. Moke. Move. I know I just moved you out of heavy cover, but I want you to take on a Zombo if you can. That ah, chance is too low. Just give me defense. Okay. Mox. You can hit him. 
Wow! You better not. That was embarrassing. You were doing, doing so well. This entire mission. And then you did that? Alright, that one was more understandable. The chance was slightly lower. Uh, you can't reload, so get behind double cover for now. That sucked. Uh, okay. Hmm. Angela, let's scoot you up a little bit. Okay. We still have 10 turns available, so I think we have plenty of time, needless to say. Randall, go ahead and intercept for me. Aim shall not of course. Give me some overwatches. Silvermane, let's go ahead and have you... Like, that one up there is dead. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, get this guy. That... Muton up there is definitely a goner. Cool. Now, judge some ammo into your gun. And give me the overwatch. We'll see what comes through, okay? Oddly enough, Butcher does not have, like, an overwatch ability. Wait. We'd break cover going over here? All right. Because you would go through the other glass, I assume? That is the assumption I'm going to stick with. All right. Let's try on this okay. corner. Hey, that's fine. Hey, what do we got? Advent, troop spotted. Advent Assault Trooper Captain. Whoa, look at that. Ooh, look at him cracking his shoulders, getting himself ready. Nice zoom out to the other guy, by the way. Uh, and now he's got radiation in his ass, and now he's dead. Cool intro, though. All right, then this guy runs right past Reynold, can somehow ignore all Overwatch. But okay. That's all right. He's going to get the business. Well, I mean, he's going to get shot by the bishop first, I guess. Please don't blow up the car. I asked you for one favor. Ugh. You gonna blow it up too? You gonna blow it up too. You dumbasses. You, you're shooting zeros over here. Yo, if, if the... If the chance to hit is zero, don't take the shot. At least that wasn't a zero. Because if you're taking these egg shots, you're not going to look like a hero. <laughs> Guys, lost. Noises. Attract to. Do you understand? Oy vey. All right. Well, now let's show them how to properly kill an exalted pathfinder. Yeah, you spotted me. Congrats. Try to give yeah, that's how you do it, you dumbasses. Oh, you're still stunned. All right, well, let's go kill this guy, too, then. Why not? Get yourself some extra exercise. Down he goes. One less eyesore. Plan to make my escape. to improvise. All right, and then I guess because you get infinite movement points, go ahead and head back down this way. Let's go. All right, good stuff. I think we're clear right now, so let's go ahead and get the and get the target or the VIP towards the target, I should say. I will not waver. Everyone else, give me some Overwatches. You still have moves left? What in the world? Uh, Mox, go ahead and reload. Cover me. Make a full reload. There we go. Okay. My aim shall not fall. Very well. Beautiful. Here they are. I knew they were coming. They couldn't resist. That's a lot of dudes. Thankfully, that also means it's a lot of uh, Overwatch shots. All right, Mox, I get it. You get the Overwatch, good. Oh, you Overwatch, very good. Just regular shots you can't seem to take. All right. Nice shot, Reynold. I think, he, I think he actually killed one, but I'm not 100% sure. Mox, however, is going to just use all of his ammo today. Oh, he totally killed one then. Nice. Didn't kill that one. Wow, Silvermane. Makes some real XCOM baby uh, shots here. I think that was an execution. 
All right. Your Templar's gonna actually do anything? You're just gonna dance. I've seen your Templar dances before. All right, I'm not impressed. I don't know what it would take to impress me with a dance, but y'all ain't doing it. But you're trying, so I guess I'll give you an A for effort. All right, I need to send someone up a ladder now. Can you let me do that, please? Okay. Auto loaded. Locked and ready to go. Well, hello there. Well, yes, I did know you were here. Pet got their attention. Yes, it did. Go ahead and oof him, please. You void strike. Kill. Alright. Apparently, you're not allowed to get extra strikes after that, so you can just go outside. It's fine. I think we do have to kill them, though. So, you know what? Let's, uh, let's just freaking. Let's just freaking see if this can do something to him. Just shoot some juice over there. I'm gonna pretend there wasn't a Templar Apostle over there, and also that they are, Templars are still our friends and don't hate us now. Um, we can pretend that, right? Can I talk to the right person? Thank you. Come up here and uh -huh. press the buttons. Give me the beep beep boop, please. So is that fuse box or something around? All right. Uh, yeah, I'll take 25 extra income if you'll do that favor for me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Very nice, very nice. Are we done? Or are there more lost? Menace 1 5, status confirmed. Be ah. advised. Advent transports are inbound. Firebrand cannot approach the AO. Reload. Secure the area and neutralize all hostile contacts. Tell the uh, reinforcements to bring it on. Uh, yeah. I will watch. I await their approach. Okay, team's ready. Where they at? Butcher's hidden again. Uh. There they are. Okay. They've got friends. Assuming it's a tank. Don't ask me why. Okay. Go ahead and uh. Yeah, give me the uh, pistol I overwatch still. Okay. Of course, you don't have an overwatch or anything like that. So go ahead and just hunker down for now, Butcher. Doing this is the only way not to die, yes? Yes. If we need you, we will uh, utilize your services. Down. Okay. Uh, Marina, won't you get into the building and hide? Yep. Okay. Doc, you're in a good spot. Ah. Moke! Where can I send you? Can I send you upstairs around the pool? Ah ha ha ha! Changing position. Give me an overwatch up there. Hello? And from there you will get the slappage. Okay. Next up, Mox. Where can I send you? Up that way? Actually, you might be able to get some good kitty corner shots from there as well. Whoop! And ready. Uh, give me a reload. I must reload. Now you're ready. Their approach. Okay, Silverhand, you are just in a beautiful spot. I, am their deaths. I mean, that is the idea. Understood. Move up a little bit, Angela, and then I think you'll be in a this great spot like a good place. to make things happen. Let's see what they got. There's the ground. tank I've been waiting for. I mean, come on, you knew there was going to be a tank. I knew there was going to be a tank. Nice shot, Reynold. For the honor of the chapter. Everyone knew there was going to be a tank. Nice crit on that other guy, and he's dead. All right, the tank, is it going to move, or does it have to wait for this turn? I think it has to wait for one turn, just like our tanks do. Granted, our tanks don't get 100 armor, or 100 health. If it had 100 armor, we'd be in a big, big, big trouble position. Four of them coming in. Yep, that's what they do. Okay. So let's see here. Bail. What do you got? Staggering shot, which has less damage. Hot shot. Pierces two armor. That's not enough. Okay. Hold up. We need someone else to be able to shred through some of that armor. And it ain't you. And it ain't Doc. 
Yeah, he gets shred through one, which is uh, not enough. Can't stun it, though, which is kind of interesting when you think about it. Could try to freeze it. Let's hold off on that. We'll do that at the end if we need it. Okay, you got any shred? No, but you can ignore some armor. Whiplash will do a ton of extra damage to the tank. In fact, I think it might be double whipping action. And it doesn't even cost an action. So, whip it. Whip it good. Nicely done. There's a howler way back there, apparently. Chasing fire from Silver Rain means that for no extra actions, we tear through four armor at the same time. Your turn. Give me the whip here, Mox. Good stuff. Down to 36, 38 health. I can see numbers. Okay. Hold up. Silvermane, what do you got? 15 to 18? I know I could have you utilize the smart core, but I want to avoid it. Let's go ahead and overdrive. Good stuff. Okay, give me a range, close range shot. Yeah, a mid range shot, really. Okay, do it one more time. There is a chance this gets a kill. Come on, baby. That's the sauce. I will endure a thousand deaths before I yield to that order confirmed. Okay, now you two can go back into Overwatch, which is exactly what I want. Wait. Get some. This is beautiful. Okay. Butcher, you don't need to move. Right. Alright. Uh, Raynal, I'm just going My Overwatch. Shall not fall, okay, what do they got now? I've got eyes on an advent position. I don't see a tank, so I don't see a problem. That green glow looks beautiful. Hmm. Three shots to take out the uh, Andromedon armor. Did eventually get it, though. Oh, gosh, you missed the Elite Honor Guard. But the crossfire from the skirmishers got him, though. That was sweet. Bailey got the uh, pyro right in the ass. Nice. Mm, it was a prime. That explains it. It looked, it looked really neat. Oh, well, the Templar Apostle and Bishop are no longer... They were stunned because of who we had do the hack. Which is a little nuts. I mean, it's also kind of too bad because I enjoyed not having them take their actions. But, hey, they might actually get this kill force that we could leave, right? Actually, there's at least one lost back there somewhere. As long as it doesn't hit you, it's fine, Mox. It hit you. Uh, it actually didn't hit. Well, it, it it you got felted by it a little bit, but you'll be fine, theoretically. Okay, fail. Take it. Nicely done. No longer a threat. Weapons burning ammo fast. Okay, move back here, butcher. Sounds good to me. There's someone who we've. Oh, there you are. Is it just this howler? I think it might just be this howler. Yes, yes, we do see you. That's uh, why we're here. Go ahead and give it the uh, Void Slash, which should get the kill. Love it. Status confirmed. All hostiles are down and the area is secure. Woo! Status Lots of confirmed. good things mission in that mission that we got to fight. Hot damn, and we get all the rewards and corpses and all that good stuff. So what are we looking at here? 12 kills and 223 damage for Bale, and that still didn't get the MVP. Damn. 6 and 128 for Butcher. 2 kills and 54 damage for Reynold. 1 and 23 for Angela. 14 kills and 253 damage gives Silvermane the MVP. Woof. 14 kills and 202 damage for Mox. 4 kills and 64 damage for Moke. 2 and 31 for the Doc. And goodness me gracious. We got some numbers up in this one, baby. Woo! I'm digging it. I like all that happened there. Although, like I said, a lot of people are going to be tired after that mission. Which means far less people 
that might be able to go on that other mission where we are probably going to get ambushed from that covert action, but we don't know for sure, at least not yet. We'll find out when we find out, right? To this month's recruitment quotas. Citizens are encouraged to voluntarily visit their nearest recruitment center. Voluntarily, Remember, huh? Only together can we build a better tomorrow. All right. Well, we'll get the building later. But uh, after we get you guys off of here, that is. Beautiful work, everybody. Bring them on home. Today. We'll fill my with pride. All right, beautiful. Someone did ask who has the most kills on the team, and I'm not, I don't remember if there's an easy way to see that in game. Uh, Butcher is almost shaken already, if not shaken right now. Silver Rain's at 174 though, and he might be close to the top, if not there. Ooh, superior conditioning's pretty good. Eight Pathfinder corpses, eight Terror rounds, eight Stun Mines, which I think we need to research. Whoo, disabled scanners, corpses. This was good. This was real good. Assault trooper captain autopsy. You have done an outstanding job. 338 supplies. Commander. Holy cow. Uh, Butcher is shaken. Okay. Can we go to the living quarters and see that stat in personnel? I honestly don't remember. We can see soldiers, engineers, and scientists. Get, we can talk with the legend. It is a legend, in case you wonder what all this stuff means. Um, because there's a lot of stuff. But I don't think kills. Oh wait, it's kills. It's the skull icon, but where where's the skull icon? Oh, details. See, I'm not smart. You can see the numbers. Hello. But if I sort it by class, does that do anything? No, it just sorts it literally by class. That's not helpful. Go back to rank, please. So yeah, now you can't see the actual kills per person. Croc's at a sweet 200. He might actually be at the top. In fact, I think he is. 116 for Mox. 114 for Allyship Jim. Damn. 101 for uh, Profit. Yeah, it's it's 116, 106 for Papa Bear. Papa Bear has not been with us that long, so getting 106 already is great. Purple at 112. I didn't even know he was in the three-digit club. 148 for Sin, 146 for Dismas, 150 for Vasilla, 108 for Parish. Yeah, but your question was, who is the most killingest of us all? And the answer is apparently Croc. With uh, 200 big ones. On his belt. Unfortunately, if you go to this little kill thing here, it doesn't actually show you the list. So that's why I didn't rely on going to this screen. Toggle abilities. Look at all them abilities and traits that don't show up. Uh, anyway. Very cool. Very cool. Well, that, however, is going to be it for this episode of that plays XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. I'm saying that, but then I'm heading to the uh, Geoscape. Why? You might be asking. Or you might not. I don't know what you're asking these days, you know? Uh, let's just go to, I don't know, what's what's closest by? The skirmisher base? Let's go here for a minute. We have a, uh, we have a science that's almost done. So we'll make a neat gun. What did you do now? Why did you do this? Commander, the aliens now, really? Progress on the Avatar project. I was We're just about to show off my new down, science. To move fast. You're gonna do this in front of my new science machine. How dare you? Our team right. is actually quite efficient. Yes, Commander. Yes. This is what I was hoping to see. Multiple new researches. Let's go ahead and get that stun mine out of the way. Okay, we got two days before finding Raiders. So I'm gonna get this one done and then wrap it up. All right. Alien facility coordinates locked in, Commander. Cool. Biomech troopers, assembled claw. Need to take an officer, of course. Mole rats are here. So you have the foundation. Uh, the enemy gets a bonus damage to reaction fire. And we get a bonus action point for the whole mission. That's going to be fun. All right. Oh, and they just get another point. They just got three points on the Avatar project. In like no time. Commander, 
If we want to set back the aliens' work on the Avatar project, we should hit one of their facilities as soon as possible. You don't say. Can I have my this stun mine research now? Thank you. Okay. Hey, look, we got a proximity stun mine. Who would have thought? Kind of, kind of saw that one coming. To be honest with you. Hmm. And then we could get their scanners as well, which I don't think is going to be as helpful and cool, but. You never know. Could be helpful. Could be cool. Could be both of those simultaneously. But that is going to be it for this episode of That Plays. XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. If you enjoyed it, make sure to help me nosin by giving it a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe. If you want to see more, it'll keep coming. It won't stop coming. It'll does stop coming, and then it'll stop. Thanks again for watching this episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is That, and I'll see you in the next video. Everybody-o's. Yo.